So there you have six BeagleBoard XM. BeagleBoard XMs, each running at one gigahertz. And they're synchronized somehow. They're synchronized, yeah. This is running uh, Media Player, uh, FFmpeg, okay. um, with an app special application okay. written by Montreal Guard, uh, which we call OMAP FB Play. And we're able to synchronize video across the six BeagleBoards. And uh, pretty nice. It's like an ultra high, high definition kind of thing. That's our, our video wall. Video wall. How many can you synchronize in theory? As many as you like. Really? Yeah. yeah this, this, they're being synchronized with network, network messages across the, uh, the device. Is that what people use in the airports and stuff when they have huge video walls? Uh, they could? They potentially could do, yes. Yeah. And so, as you have a, this remote, then you can exit? Little, little remote control. You can stop that, and we can see this is running a Angstrom Linux distribution uh, with GNOME Desktop. So you have six installations, right? Six, yeah. Each, each board is, uh, is really identical, uh, running the same software. Uh, the mouse is synchronized across the devices yeah. using uh, Synergy. And you can see that the devices can also support 3D graphics. Uh, we can do live texture streaming of uh, video onto uh, the surfaces of a spinning cube. We can cute embedded examples. And, uh, that's the Beagle Wall. All right. Here at Embedded World in Nuremberg. The XM is an upgrade of the first Beagle Ball, right? That's right. It's a 1 gigahertz version using the DM3730. Uh, it's got 512 megabytes of uh, memory. Uh, and it includes some um, new uh, connections as requested by community feedback. So we have a camera input. And we have uh, USB based Ethernet and hub included. Nice. Commonly uh, requested features as well as a bit more memory and a few more megahertz over the original people. And it's a very cheap price, no, for a kit? Yeah, How much is it? $149. $149. Yeah. All right. More information at BeagleBoard.org. Thanks.